Hello, you're on the air. Really? Yeah, first you First time caller. First time caller. Hey, excellent. Yeah. Nice. To, well, are you a long time viewer? <laughs> well, first time viewer. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Well, welcome to our show. How are you? I'm doing well, doing well. Thank you. Do you have anything you want to share with everybody? Well, I just want to ask, why do, why do we in America uh, need the right to bear arms? I don't understand that. We had a rash of shootings, and they had these big guns. Why do somebody need that? Well, I'll tell you the answer, sir. Um... I was talking to Sonnet in the gas station today, believe it or not. I was fixing my headlight, and Sonnet had a great perspective. I asked him to call the show, but I don't think he's had time. But his point was that it's different in different circumstances. The guy that lives in Wyoming by himself in a hundred, middle of a hundred of acres that some criminal can come and murder him, like in Truman's Capote um, in Cold Blood. I don't know if you ever read that book, but it, if you ever live out in the country and you read his book, you're going to buy a gun. That's normal. What's not normal is that people like us in the city have guns because we can accidentally kill other people. And his suggestion was that the sheriff of the town, and I know each town's got sheriffs. I know New York's got to have a sheriff. Mm -hmm. I mean, that the sheriff says, you know, this is what my town is, how it works, because, and that the sheriff gets the rule, and we should make the law fix it that way. Because then they could just say, look, no one in New York City can have a gun. If, you, if, you, if you're if fine caught with a gun, that's it, man. You're out. It's like double parking. We should fix that and str empty out the roads and collect a lot of money. The solutions are easy. True that. Very understanding. Thank you. Yeah, pleasure. Thanks for calling. You have a happy new year, sir. Likewise. Thank you so much for calling. Thanks for watching. Watch every week, 8 p.m. Live, right here. Every week at 8 p.m. We've been doing it for five years, sir. Thanks for sure. being our first-time viewer and our first-time caller. You're a brave, wonderful person. Thank you. Yeah, pleasure.